morning, eighth graders and soon to be ninth grade freshmen here at PHS. My name is Cameron Pickens and I'm a senior at, here at Piedmont High School. My job today is to come to you and tell you about our new health science program here at PHS. The patient care tech class that I took last year has enabled me to begin my career in the medical field. During the first semester of the class, we learned about the different ways to take care of a patient. We were able to get certified in CPR and use a simulator to practice a real life situation where the man mannequin died and were performed CPR until he had a pulse again. The simulator is real cool and before he died he told us that he did not feel well and then flatlined on the monitor. During the second semester we were able to use the skills that we had learned and put them into use in the nursing home and, uh, and doctor offices around Piedmont. We could also become a certified nursing assistant during this class. This helps you to be able to get a job and also if you are going into nursing, having a CNA certification will help you get into a nursing program sooner in college. We also completed in the HOSA Health Oc Occupation Students of America Student Club. We were able to go to Montgomery and compete in different areas of health science from the medical term terminology, nursing assistant, forensics, and many others. I was able to do my in internship at Dr. Mohan's office, and this led me to getting a job for the summer and also to be able to co-op this year. I get the best of both worlds, school and working in the healthcare field. I will not take anything for my time in the health science program. Thank you. Hi, I'm Emma Young. I'm in ninth grade and I go to Piedmont High School and I take foundations of health sciences and medical terminology. In medical terminology, I've learned how to take parts of a word and put it with another part to make it a whole word. And that way, when you learn the root and when you learn the other part, you just put them together and you basically know what it is. So if you're taking a test and you're like, oh, I know this part, but I don't know this part, you can easily just, you know, hey, this means this. I'm just going to guess that this means whatever goes with it. Tell us about the apron here. Okay, this apron is something we made. We were learning about the digestive system and we were just looking for some projects, you know, kind of got fed up with work. So we were just looking for some projects and we did this. It's the outline of your whole digestive system. This is Fred. He will be here watching you 24 seven, making sure you're doing everything right. This is McDreamy, but you know McDreamy died. My name is Kristen Myers and I'm currently a junior at PHS and taking the patient care tech classes. We're in the middle of our internship and I'm working at Dr. Orrick's office. I'm able to bring patients back in the office and obtain their blood pressure, chemistry, and heart rate. I assist the nurses and doctors in the office in any way that I possibly can. We were able to go and compete in the host of competition in Montgomery and that was a lot of fun and we got out of school for two days. Brady and I are going to demonstrate how to do CPR in the simulator. Analyzing heart rhythm. Do not touch the patient. Shock advised. Charging. Stay clear of patient. Deliver shock now. Shock delivered. Pause. Begin CPR. My name is Shreya Calloway and I'm a junior at PHS also. I was able to take medical terminology last year and that helped me learn medical terms and understand more what they are talking about in Grey's Anatomy. I feel like I could carry on a conversation with someone in the medical field and actually understand what they are talking about now. This year, I decided to take patient care tech because I want to be a nurse or a doctor someday. This class has helped me understand the nursing profession a lot more. I am able to put my skills into practice at the nurse practitioner's office in Piedmont. I would encourage anyone wanting to go into the medical fields to definitely take the health science classes. So this is the egg shop and uh, there's a lot of different things you can do down here. We've got construction classes, framing classes, uh, welding classes, we can work with metal. And uh, just for some basics, these are two of the main saws we use and um, do a lot of construction with it, a lot of woodwork, cutting um, with that one. 
go like this, and this one you can straight down with it. Cut it. So behind me now is one of our newest pieces of equipment that we've added to the ag shop, and it's the plasma cutter. And it enables us to cut out really personal things like, oh, we just finished a uh, trailer in our welding class. You can see uh, the name of the man we made it for is I sent Garrett, so we made a little plate that says Garrett. And we also custom out, cut out these custom peas that are going to be on all the, uh, the lights around school. So doing a lot of big things with the new equipment. So this piece of equipment right here is what we actually use to cut out a piece of metal when we go to weld them. Like as you can see this is a piece that we cut out from this machine that way that we can weld this onto something. And behind me through those windows are our arc welders and that is a personalized welding station where we actually weld things together and those are uh, pretty much brand new. They came in here last summer so they've only been used a year and it's really fun to make stuff with metal. In horticulture, you can plant plants with Coach Mitchell and learn. he'll teach you how to propagate and correctly plant the plants. And for Mother's Day, you can take a flower home for your mother. Horticulture is a great class and it teaches you strong work ethic and focus and you get to propagate and plant and build on the greenhouse. And if you're lucky, you'll get selected to go to Auburn University where you can learn even more from people who have been in the field from high school and have chosen it as a job preference. I enjoy the class because, well, I like pretty things. I like flowers and I like planting them and watching my work grow and increase. And Coach Mitchell is a great influence to have because he helps you understand it in, you know, not complicated science books though, but you get 